So what is it about Wish.com that keeps me coming back? Hi, thanks for joining me. I'm Miss Jenny, and today we're going to be talking about Wish.com yet again. My friend bought me something from Wish.com, and I haven't really had a chance to explore it yet. It is in a bag. I know what it is, but I don't know how it's going to look. So I have the package right here. Thank you again to my friend Jen for giving me this awesome gift. It is right here. As you can tell, it is in a plastic bag. It is red. And that's probably all you can tell. There's some buckles. So she told me I got wings. And uh, I wasn't exactly sure what that meant. So let's find out what that means together. So in case you don't know, red is one of my favorite colors of all time. It used to be my nickname way back in the day, and I love wearing it. It's one of my signature colors along with black and leopard print. So she got me these red wings things, and it's a harness, and it is in multiple pieces. It does have a very, like, like a leathery, like a fake leather smell maybe a little little chemically <sighs> maybe I'll get <laughs> stop it <laughs> okay <clears throat> so already it's in a couple different pieces so assembly required <laughs> this piece here I have then this one here. Okay, the rest of it is in one piece. So this one is an extra piece. Oh, this is cool. This is really cool. So um, what I'm seeing here, uh, besides all of this metal work, is that the wings are have three different pieces overlayered on top of each other to give it more of a um, 3D effect, which is very cool. I like this a lot. It's very substantial. Um, these don't feel cheap, by the way. They they feel like they can like hold up, like the metal is good. Um, there is a very, very slight give to here. It's a little stretchy, which is good, but not too stretchy to make me think like, what? Why? I believe this part goes on your back and it straps all the way around to the front. Let's see if we can figure it out. Okay, okay here back. Uh, first, I don't know how much I'm going to need them to be done, so I'm going to put them on the first hole first um, until I get it on me. I put it. I put it on wrong already. I did one thing and I already put it on wrong. Hold on. It's already complicated. It was already complicated. And that way I can slip it on like a half backpack, right? <laughs> These two don't go together. They're too. <laughs> um, what? Oh, yeah, this will be easy. This one here. Yeah, because you know, I could figure it out. Because then this fits here. Okay. Okay, so now that I have them um, in, I am going to finish uh, tightening and putting all the way in, and then we're going to give it a little look see and uh, twirl around and see if I can fly. See if I can fly. Oh, what is wrong with me today? What's wrong with today? Today. 
I don't know, yesterday you were normal and today you're like the Chinese guy from Karate Kid. So I've tightened some things up here. Um, first things I'll note are I, it fits me, which is good with uh, room to spare. So this is available for um, bigger body types as well. But because of how much I had to tuck in the straps up here, I have all of this extra. <laughs> I have these extra straps here, which kind of um, don't necessarily help the aesthetic. So I'm gonna see if I can just fold them under real quick. All right, so I just tucked it under. It is not necessarily the cutest, um, but it is a different dimension. It definitely doesn't look as bad as the things. Overall, this is a really awesome. It's really cool. I really like it. It feels good. Um, it hits me in the right spot here. I'm gonna um, turn around and show you what the back looks like here. Let me uh, clip my hair up real quick. Oh, oh, who is she? Who is she? Never looks so cute. So, um, besides my hair looking atrocious, you can see the wings are fabulous. That dimension looks really great. It has all the right metal pieces in the right spot. I adore this. This is so perfect for like a cute night out or um, just really doing anything you want. It drops right on my natural waist and it kind of really emphasizes um, that portion and I love this this is great so as you can see on the front it does do a little drop down like that um, oh, I love this so much this is awesome I feel comfortable wearing this it is big enough to fit a plethora of bodies and it is small and simple enough to wear out for wherever you're going when i go out seeing karaoke at the bar when we can finally do that again um psa do not leave your house still quarantine Uh, but until then, I can just wear this whenever I want on Twitch Sings for my fake karaoke pleasures. If you guys haven't heard of Twitch Sings, go check it out. Follow me on Twitch to see me sing randomly bad. Sometimes have a good spot, but it's just Jenny Capcho on Twitch. I'm going to wear this probably tonight while I'm singing Lucky You. <laughs> Hair coming back. <sighs> I've been Miss Jenny. This has been an excellent episode. I adore my piece. Thank you so much to my friend Jen, which you can check her out on episodes of Overbooked on Durger Time or on her podcast Film Buffing Up. Just check out Film Buffing Up, where she and her man Candy take a look at the top 100 films from the American Film Institute. It's interesting. I love this series. Go check them out. I'll put a link down below. Thank you guys for watching. I've been Miss Jenny. Have a great day. Oh, bye.